Alrighty, welcome everyone. Another episode of Spider Man 2. Uh, I literally had to uh, record. I'm gonna have to re record. Um... <sighs> the whole section because my capture card didn't record um, the last one, unfortunately. So. I believe that was the last one. Okay, now I'm confused. <laughs> This is a manual slot. But I see two manual slots here. I have Okay. Let's hold this one just in case. Okay, that was the one that was further set. Okay, so no. Not that one. You see it actually changes menu screen. Ah! So it has to be this one, right? Okay. Yeah, it was this one. Okay. I need to switch the computer. But we have one more of the missions here to do. So unfortunately, we won't get to see all the... Um, Puzzles I was doing. What am I doing? Guys, getting up in those people's faces. I'm there. We're ending this now. Grab this. Back 
up, huh? I'll take that as a compliment. Maybe call for some better help next time? I mean, at this point, I'm not a little too good in this game, and I'm still playing it. Spectacular difficulty, just in case. I got someone trying to tell me otherwise. Yeah. Um, so where we are. Oh my gosh, I still haven't reached there yet. in the air with this. Nice speed chase. All right. Oh my god. I yeah, guaranteed I lost him. Yeah, I lost him. Okay, whatever. I'm like I'm trying to get to my objective and they keep throwing me new new crimes. Sorry in advance for turning all your illegal stuff in. Wow. Do that. Okay. Yeah. Don't take. Damage. I know how to close the deal. Sun this 
side. Or not. What? Bruh. What, what's going on here? I can pull that steam pipe up. Sweet. Oh, what Miles was doing this now? Looks like that's all the stashes. Wait, my suit sinking to another one? It's right by where I met up with Thunk. Maybe his codes buggy? I should go check with him. Uncle Aaron? Ah, no. Where'd he go? Jesus. He did have a stash here. to my apartment building. He wouldn't plan a heist there, would he? Better get home quick. Hey. What are you doing, Uncle Aaron? Really hope this isn't what it looks like. Yeah, kind of, kind of 
kind of like the speed of the web wings here. Uncle Aaron? Yeah. These pictures of Dad and Uncle Aaron when they were kids. Mm-hmm. Record player is gone. Did he steal from us too? That's one of Dad's records. Christmas baby. Go, really Aaron's still here. Can't let him take any more stuff. me what are you doing here without breaking parole you said you were retiring the prowler you lied to me whoa 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 slow down there mijo mom we were going to surprise you but okay what's going on here when you started helping out your uncle i was inspired despite all the things he did you forgave him so i decided to do the same and help him out by co-signing the lease on this apartment thanks again rio <laughs> It'll be nice to have family close by again. Meant what I said. Prowler's in the rearview mirror. I want us to have a future together. Be a family. I also said I'd find a way to thank you, didn't I? What is it? Some tech I was prototyping before I got caught up with Roxxon. Could come in handy. I guess Uncle Aaron really is making room for the future. One floor up. Can't wait to try this tech out. Cool. Yeah, 
because you get the whole 30 frames or no 24 frames animation style kind of like the, in the first game or no with Miles Morales there's a whole into the spider verse there change into that suit. But given how I guess I don't have it. that one yet. Um yeah, I'll save that white one for another time. I'll wear this. Uh, yeah, it's... Couldn't do that one with the web shooters. And yeah, the guy heavily skilled up Miles. Switch to Peter. Oh, I really brought back the same animation. Hey, okay. Pete, you ready to come by the foundation? Sure. I'm excited to see what you're up to. Great. I'm excited to show you. Oh, gotta grab this call from MJ. See you soon. Hey, how you doing? Good. Just got off the phone with Harry, and this foundation thing could be interesting. Oh, nice. Some hope on my work front, too. I dug into the tech that gang used to mess with the prison transfer. It's DARPA-level stuff. Yeah, whoever's behind them has a ton of resources. Miles thinks he saw their leader. Some kind of big game hunter, fur vest-looking guy. Interesting. I'll keep digging. If I can get this story on the front page, it might help us track him down faster. Maybe save my job, too. Yeah, yeah. Um, however, no, that's not it. There is, there is a particular mission that I want to get. Oh, yeah, we completed that one. It's this one. Chief Clark, everything okay? We're about to demolish a hospital that was damaged during Sandman's attack, but there's a lot of debris slowing down the technicians. If you're free, they could really use your webs to help keep the building stable while they work. Absolutely. Thanks. We'll keep working until you get here. Yeah, I didn't know... I said it before, like, I didn't know Bold's, uh, the actor who did Bold from, uh, Jedi Survivor was in this. And it's like the third game I, I hey, came across. Hey, need a dance partner? I've been waiting. Okay. Uh, 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 
take this on the road sometime. Sounds like a good excuse to finally build that spider mobile. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Oh, we took care of that. Wow, my boy really stuck up there. <laughs> Damn, look what happened to you! Yo, the ragdoll effects in this game is hilarious. But, uh, anyway. to this particular mission. Because a certain somebody is involved. Now, unfortunately, because thanks to my recording, I'm having to redo this part. Unfortunately, you guys won't get my genuine reaction. No, where we're about to go to is a surprise. Stop those cultists before they burn everything! Uh. Fire department's on its way, FYI! <laughs> 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 Fires. Good. Fire department can handle things from here. Alrighty. <laughs> Little did I know, is I actually got a second bar on that focus there. Chief. Thanks for coming. We've managed to set our explosives in every zone except the last one. The demo crew's in there. There's four of them. I'll find them. Just keep your radios open. And make sure nobody touches that detonator. No. <laughs> Spiderbot can search faster in there than I can. Your time to shine, little guy. Make Spidey Daddy proud.
find the people, Clark gets them out. Yeah, what I like is that, um... Is anyone out there? Help! Is that a robot? Hey, it's Spider-Man. I just relayed your location to fire and rescue, so they'll be here any minute. It's gonna be okay. Spider-Man, thank you. Hey, Clark. Did you get the location I just sent over? Our team's moving in now. Thanks. Spider-Man's here. It's gonna be okay. Uh, I've seen people get jump scared by this <laughs> rat here. <laughs> I mean, whoa. <laughs> a new location any time now. Just came in. We'll head right over once we finish getting Mr. Robleski out. Time for my latest upgrade. Oh shoot, it's gonna cut this way, I swear. Yeah, hey no. Clark, did you get the last location I sent your way? Heading there now. There's only one other worker left inside. Hurry, Spider-Man. Leave it to me. Ceiling debris. That might as well. No. Ah, shit. What am I supposed to go again? I get over here again. Shoot. Jacket. Make sure you help them. Hey Clark, I just sent a new location your way, but this guy said someone else is still trapped in here. Really? I'm not missing anyone else. But if you can find them, we'll get them out. I'm on. Yeah, purple jacket. Nobody those, here. Those who know. Also, oh, we're about to run into. Ah, uh, 
Uh, this will take some maneuvering. Unfortunately, yes. Mention the flame. I just, I just want it out. Then you should have remembered we all go out the same way we come in. Painfully. What's your deal? There you are. Hey! You never did like my smoking. Like, how do you not catch the police cigarette thing? Yuri. Yeah. Little life's call me Wraith. Fits pretty well, I think. I tried. Where have you been? No time. What about them? They made their choice. This will be a new record. And they said it couldn't be done. Looks like Yuri took off. I thought she'd just need some time after what happened with Hammerhead. But coming back with that suit and a name like Wraith? I should keep 
an eye on her. And the other on these cultists. I need more eyes. Hey, what's up? Just wanted to let you know that I talked to Gloria, and Feast is gonna send a donation truck to the house tomorrow for the rest of May's stuff. Uh, I don't think I'll be able to go through everything by then. Could you cancel that? I promise I'll donate it all myself as soon as I'm finished with... everything. I'll call him right now. But... don't push yourself too hard, Parker. I'm serious. Hey, you know I'd much rather be curled up next to you with the latest physics journal right now. <sighs> Especially that French one. Sometimes you're just too romantic. I'll talk to you later. Yeah, y'all idea of romantic is... unique. We'll, we'll just call it that. Alright. This suit. But I'm gonna switch it to this one. Oh, he doesn't need breath. is going to come in handy. Under that, I think. Start working with these. Um, let's see. I was going to use that one instead. Suit. Oh, right. This is like what? This is like the same thing, just one with more green and brighter purple. Got Wraith out of the way. wondering what this place was. You made it! 
I thought you said this was a startup. Yeah, I was hoping for something a little less this. But my dad was the one who, you know, he made all the arrangements. Peter and... Parker. <laughs> so, what do you think? It's a far cry from that chop shop that Otto had you in. <laughs> and now that you're on board, this place is really gonna start cooking. Notice how Osborne is in a gr all green here going on. Hey, Dad, Pete hasn't decided he's joining yet. Oh. Really? But I was gonna give him a tour. Let him decide for himself. All right. You know, seeing you boys together again. <laughs> right then. Have fun. Get your badge out. Let's go exploring. So the first thing I want to show you is downstairs. Harry, this place, right? Dad went a little more over the top than I would have liked. How did you... Got things set up while I was still undergoing treatment, but when I got out, I made a few changes. Like what? Diverted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research aligned with our mission, to heal the world. First, I want you to meet Dr. Young, who's a leading entomologist. You know what entomology is? Yeah. Dr. Young is doing this super cool research on bees. Or, to be more precise, on bee predators. Hmm. Uh, I did a lot of this exploring before, so I'll show you guys again. I just checked in on Harry. Pep data is not tabulated with the AI learning we did during the last milestone. Ready to talk to Dr. Young? You must be Peter. So nice to meet you. I think you'll like this project. Great to meet you, Dr. Young. Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline, primarily due to a significant predator, a carnivorous bee wolf. So we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Want to see how? This is cool. These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that were trained to detect and attack bee wolves. AKA bee wolf wasps. And you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. Do you see those little holographic bee wolves? The better you are at shooting those, the better our drones get at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves away, not to Oh, nice. Yes! You're done, Peter. A very productive session. We got great data. Okay, flying home. Welcome to Entomology. If those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real, you'd have saved the lives of about 2,500 bees. Wow. I'd love to help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. I've got so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. Yeah, the only beauty of this... Now, up ahead is the medical research area. We're doing cutting-edge proton beam work, using protons instead of x-rays, with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. That's the idea. The only beauty of this is like on these slow parts, I can actually speed it up. <laughs> Harry, a moment if you please. Well, I'll still be, uh, I'll show it to you guys. Any chance it can, wait a sec. It'll be quick. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, Doc, this is my friend Peter. Peter, Dr. Connors. Crazy, they brought We've actually met. This. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. 
Oh. Yes. <laughs> it's a shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness, aches, pains, anxiety, impulsive thoughts. <laughs> nope. I've never been better. That's what worries me. Nice to see you again. Pete's face when he's, he said yes. <laughs> Your doctor is the lizard. Dad believes in second chances. Hey, listen, I gotta go make a call, but uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. So yeah. that was crazy. But it seems to be working for everyone to have Dr. Connors here. Guess I'll look around. Yeah. It's refreshing. So. This is the original prototype from Otto's lab. This would have been crime scene evidence. Wonder how it ended up here. Please. Uh, Forget this is Osborne we're talking about here. Uh, He'd have found a way. Nice. Seems inspired by some of Otto's work without the hardwiring problems. Wonder if Dr. Connors has used this. Though after that lizard rampage, he may be done testing his work on himself. The origins of life on Earth remain a mystery. How could organic life forms have arisen from non-biological chemical compounds? Recent discoveries of meteorites containing organic molecules considered the building blocks of life may provide a potent clue. Mm. Right. Um, there's two major points that we can get to. I even start. I'm talk to this lady here. Cool fish. Not just fish, research subjects. Want to feed them? Yeah. Japanese koi fish have well-studied pigmentation variation, which is ideal for our research into enhanced reflectivity. Stacks of intracellular anhydrous guanine crystals. Separated by cytoplasm, we're finding it very useful for eco-friendly roofing materials. So cool! A reminder that the sustainable energy consortium will be at lunch. Yeah, I love this place. Yeah, I don't angle hold you. I didn't understand a word she just said. <laughs> Have you been out to the Hudson Valley facility? Yeah, once. Hey, what are you doing with these bikes? We're working on ultra efficient batteries charged by bicycles. These bikes? Can I ride them? Not right now, but when they're road ready, we'll need people to test them. Nice. I'll try to come back. Yeah. Hey, whenever you're ready, come meet me up here. I'm on my way. I'll see you in a sec. Yeah, we're gonna check out the other places first. Like I said, I was gonna show you different places you can explore in here. Before we continue There's on. so much to explore. But I shouldn't keep Harry waiting. Drones. Yeah, uh, doing a little cross collaboration between the energy lab and the agricultural lab. Ultra light drones using the new battery tech for crop monitoring. Very cool. Do they collect crop data too? They will, by the time we're done with them. That's awesome. Thanks. Beehives show complex group decision making and group locomotion. Swarming is an annual process in which the colony expands and splits. The Emily May Foundation has discovered that specific changes in the honeycomb's vibrational spectra 
proceed a primary swarm. This research will help beekeepers support healthy swarming without invasive observational techniques for optimal health and reproduction in our beleaguered bee population. The need for medical organ transplants far outnumbers available donors. An innovative solution uses 3D printing technology to create custom replacement organs, decreasing the likelihood of transplant rejection and increasing the chances of a successful outcome. Here at the Emily May Foundation, this cutting edge work is being put to use saving lives. We 3D printing organs? I didn't even catch that the first time I did this. Yeah, that's a little much there, bro. Let's see what's going on here. Maybe I can help. Oh yeah, that would take a while. I'm not sure there's time to dig in now, but I'd sure like to come back and work on this later. So many cool things here. What's this? Some kind of radiation treatment, maybe? Wonder if this is what they used for Harry's treatment. Looks like Connors is putting the research he did after he lost his arm to good use. Wonder if he regrets testing that serum on himself. Must be unnerving walking around with dormant lizard DNA in your body. Welcome to space research. Okay. Imagine coming to work here every day. It's almost too good to be true. Could start paying off the mortgage. Uh, but what if Spidey work gets in the way? Gotta think this through before signing on. Yeah. Or we go here. I believe there's an elevator. There. Show us the. Upper floor is in there. I ain't gonna hold you, bro. Pete, you could be walking faster than this. Dangerously close to Robert Downey Jr. This laboratory is currently the testing ground for our GMO crops, examining real world productivity and nutritional content in plants that have been optimized for specific temperature or water stressed environments. This is where science meets real world conditions, getting us one step closer to literally feeding the planet. stuff dealing with Mr. Negative here and I can't remember where I found it. Hey, hon. I could do this forever. I but I should get to the second floor to meet up with Harry. I just to show you, you got the Yo, report, can I move? Bruh. Well, uh, 
Pretty interesting results. Yeah, that's where it was over there. Okay. The from PCR test is 17 through 26. The Emily May Foundation is working on a proposal to renovate and expand the city's aqueduct system, starting with the Central Park Reservoir, to efficiently provide clean water to everyone in the five boroughs. Yeah, it was over here where I found it. That looks familiar. Oh, this is a new form, if that's what you're thinking. It's decommissioned. We just want to know if there's anything to be learned from it for an alternate, safe energy source. Good to know. <laughs> this is a reminder that today is the last day we are accepting donations for the food drive. There's one of his swords. Interesting. Negative energy. We are trying to harness it in a way that is beneficial. That would be a good trick. Good luck. Peter, you know damn well this is not a good idea. Let's step back. Okay, so this is the PNR sequence. The problem is these red markers. Why do they dry out faster than the others? There's anything in the, in the lobby. Let's go meet with Harry. Such great stuff here. It's time to meet Harry. We use it to send proton beams to that treatment room downstairs. It's being repaired right now, but I'll have it back up in no time. Incredible. Where are we heading now? Up to the top floor. Your energy seems really good, Harry. I feel great. Did you so put your way back helmet on and think back. Even before high school. To middle school. Okay. Now, do you know the... Hang on. You're a popular guy. Sorry, it's just my tutoring job. You were saying? You know the stuff everyone studies in middle school with Gregor Mendel and the pea plants? Yeah, I think so. About genetics and plant hybridization? Exactly. So, Dr. Foster up ahead, he's won every top prize in the field for his work with plant genetics. Wow. Hey, when you were walking around, did you have a chance to feed the fish? Yes. That was so great. Interesting research project. And lowers the old cortisol levels, too. Right? I honestly think it's one of my favorite spots in the building. Yes, we need someone to come back and check the Okay, so I guess he doesn't really change his dialogue there. I see what you're saying. The algorithm is similar to long division, if you look at it that way. Got it. Mm -hmm. Thank you for this way, dude. Yeah, and here's Dr. Foster. Puzzle. Thanks, Dr. Foster. 
Ah, Peter, I presume. Harry talks about you frequently. So nice to meet you. Dr. Foster is working on agricultural efficiency. With the population growing and the climate changing unpredictably, we need to adapt more quickly than nature normally would. Genetic recombination can customize crops to best meet these new challenges, be it extreme weather or an increase in pests. Would you like to see this test bed? Okay. The idea is to tweak a plant's genes to maximize optimal qualities. For instance, a plant that can thrive in drought conditions. In our simulation, the goal is to maximize growth. Why don't you practice on this? Okay. Match the base pairs to incorporate as many growth genes as you can. That'll be a plant that can feed the world. Yeah. Now, how did I do this again? Right. With this. Interesting. Here. Okay, I think I get the hang of it. Great. Now you're ready to try the real thing. This is a plant we're working on to grow well in drought conditions. Corporations patent GMO seeds for profit and are rightly criticized. But ours are open source, developed for sustainability instead of financial gain. So smart. One step closer to feeding the world. <laughs> nice work. Listen, I know you're not officially on, but could you look at one more gene for me? Curious to get your take on it. It's a crop specifically adapted to urban gardens. Of course. Beautiful work, Peter. Using this technology, we're on track to end world hunger by 2035. Wow. I know a rooftop you could use for a real-world test if you're interested. Oh, very much so. Harry was right. You'll be a real asset here. Thank you, Dr. Foster. So now where? Last stop. Might be my favorite. It's commanding, but not overbearing. Playful, but not tasteless. Impressive, but not show off. -y. Your office. Or is it our office? Harry. Now remember, the things you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working on. But don't decide just yet, not till you've seen this last thing. Okay. Come on, where's your badge? You'll need it to get in. Uh, where did I... Put it. Don't tell me you lost it. Nope, false alarm. Right here. Mm. Go ahead. Swipe. Wow. Man. Harry. 
This is all so amazing. It's perfect, really. It's just... Things are really hectic right now. When I was in treatment, all I could think about was, what would I do if I survived? And I kept hearing my mom's voice telling me that our planet is in trouble. And it's my responsibility to save it. If you join me, there's so much more that we can do. I mean, we both know you're the smarter one. <laughs> Come on. Let's make my mom and me proud, huh? It's amazing. But there's one thing. Can I move my desk over there? I like to face the wall when I work. <laughs> <laughs> Quick thing. <laughs> I'm going to need a little time to transition out of my tutoring job. Of course. Take whatever time you need. It's all about balance, right? Coney Island later, yeah? You bet. <laughs> oh, hey, I forgot to tell you. Some of our researchers have field experiments set up around the city. If you have time, check them out. I've sent you the locations, and your badge will grant you access. All right, I'll swing by. Hey. Hey, sorry I didn't get back to you before, but I was... I just got a new job. For real? That's yeah. awesome. Where's it at? This new foundation run by my best friend. It's... it's incredible. But I can fill you in later. What's up? The guys who took Lee and Scorpion? Genki and I tracked the exhaust trails from their aircraft to the Williamsburg Bridge. I'll meet you there. Hold on! Don't you have an essay to finish? Yeah, but duty calls. Trust me, your duty is to your future right now. I'll keep you updated on anything I find. All right. Good luck out there. All right. This is where the action begins. See any bad guys? Maybe Miles and Genki had it wrong. Hey, I'm at the bridge, but there's no sign of our mysterious safari pirates. Ah, oh, man, we were sure it was there. Sorry about the wild goose chase. Don't sweat it. We'll find him. Uh, glittering? Come on, man. Seriously? 
Seriously, though, where's your boss take Lee and Gargan? You criminals? Not far. They're enjoying their freedom. That's not ominous at all. Take a look around. What do we have here? Maybe it'll lead me to some answers. Okay, Birdie. Take me to your nest. Gonna miss these chases when I'm at Emily May. The adrenaline, going through the city like it's an obstacle course, never gets old. Getting to do real science, though. For actual money. Oh my god, I finally did it. I have a stable career. Okay, cool it, Parker. You daydream about those fat science decks later. Time to chase. Whoa, is that a real gun? That actually works? Come on, what am I doing? Up, up, and you won't get away! No, 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 no! Nice cloaking tech! Mind if I take a look under the hood? Okay. I'll take that as a no. That's too close now. I wonder if I can get my suit to identify their visual frequencies. I don't see your boss around. Where's he hiding? I want to talk to him about his lifestyle choices. What are you on? Get him out of here. Alright. Now, where's your boss? Don't tell me anything. Okay. Another oh, robot. Maybe I can test something out. Okay. Let's see. Sorry, Birdie. This is just as awkward for me as it is for you. There should be a. Yep. Oh. Is that your home? Send this location to MJ. Maybe she can dig up some building records. Where are we going now? Hey, MJ, did you get that location data I sent you? Yeah, it's an old food market. Owner died last year. Building sold a few weeks ago. Wait. This buyer. There's some shell company that's been acquiring property all over the city. Like, whole city blocks. 
I tried to do a story on them last month, but the trail dried up. Every person I was talking to just vanished. Go make yourselves useful. Our departure is imminent. Who are these people? I want to find out. Good luck. I need to take these two out nice and quiet. And the rest of the hunters? Their blinds are all set up and communications have been linked. Okay, We're ready. I know how to do stealth. To hunting. Gotta draw one of them away. That's okay. That's one. fast. You find something? Two things. This armed group calls themselves hunters. And they've got a lot of accents. Hmm. International mercenaries? That's what I'm thinking. Could be front page material for your article. I'm writing it up now. Thanks. Oh, and Connection. speaking of work, Generators I accepted Harry's offer. That's fantastic. We should celebrate later after you're done with your current work. Tony, talk soon. Sixth incident, I got put on, what do they call it? A uh, leave of absence, so I torched their building. Nice. Hold up in my place afterwards and waited for him to come for me. But it was Craven who did. Asked me if I wanted to hunt real game. And here I am. Atta boy. What was that noise? It was nothing. Surveillance video from the blind I was just at. Hmm. Looks like they've got others all around the city. I'll send this to Ganky, but he could help pinpoint these. What's Craven hunting? And why? Yes, it's loaded. Whatever you see, just make sure the beasts have the right scent. You hungry too? <coughs> Down you go. Aw, for me? You shouldn't have. Sturdy and flexible. Hmm. I wonder. 
Nice. Crazy. He just can 3D print his gadgets now. Like, what the hell? Time to take my shiny toy for a test drive. Surrounding bases are online. Remaining blind secured. Locking fields operational. Good. Beetles. Talon drones. Ammunition. Russians. These guys are better equipped than most armies. This Craven guy must be rich. We're well connected. We're both. This is the only way. Okay. Oh, I guess I have to. A research lab? Yeah. Craven studying Lee's blood. Maybe he's trying to figure out where his powers came from. Or how to get them for himself. Aunt May was so proud of her work at Feast. Lee broke bad in a big way. I just hope that doesn't mean everything he ever touched was corrupted. An inner demon mask. Lee's old superpowered gang. Craven better not be trying for the same with his hunters. Still well? His genetic experiments gave Scorpion his abilities. Craven sure does his research. part of Scorpion's poison. If Craven's adding this to his arsenal... Ugh. That's... the Tiara Apitahi. One of the rarest flowers in the world. Its extract has some pretty powerful medicinal properties. I tried to get some years ago to counteract Scorpion's poison, but couldn't afford the flights to... Riotea? Guess Craven could. Were they testing their weapons on that armor? Whoa! And not a single scratch? Almost an exact replica. Must have been probing it for weaknesses. Can never be too careful with Scorpion. Wait a sec. Hey, 
MJ, I have another name for you. Craven. Seems like he's the boss of these guys. And he's here on some kind of hunt. Craven the Hunter. What's he hunting? Whatever it is, it definitely involves Scorpion and Lee. Mind looking into this Craven guy in the meantime and letting Miles know what's up? Already on it. Stay safe. How many more fires must we light out in the city? As many as we need to. Craven said they surround you. But if his dream is accurate, then the fires are fated to happen anyway. Why not wait for them? They will happen on his terms, not fates. How about this? The... Nice to sleep here. <coughs> oh, that stuff tastes awful. Wow. They got traps in here. That's interesting. I was worried Lee wouldn't have any spirit left in him. Locked away for so long. He's like a coil. The spider! Look up! Wait. We can run the fire! I could really use some answers instead of questions right now. All right, Craven. What are you looking for? Wait. I get bringing Scorpion and Lee on a hunt, but Black Cat's a thief. I don't. Never gonna win best in show with that attitude! <laughs> nice, doggy, kitty, robot! Yeah, we got a lot of trouble here. Those teeth are no joke! Finally! I was wondering when animal control. 
Patrol would show up. Guys, putting together quite the team. Yeah, except he's not really putting together a team. He's hunting them. Just off 
scorpion, bro. <laughs> Crazy. Where are you? Estás listo? For what? En serio? My date's almost here and you're surfing the web? My, no one says surfing the web anymore. <sighs> Can you just please get dressed? Okay, okay. See, you got your good lipstick on. <laughs> you must really like this guy, huh? Miles? I'm sorry. Look, next time, I promise. I, Miles. I love you. I found a base belonging to those safari pirates, or hunters, as they call themselves, and learned their boss's name, Craven. And he killed Scorpion. And he's got a whole hit list of supervillains. Wait, what? Does this mean Lee? I'm not sure. Come to think of it, these hunters must have been who Marco was so afraid of in his memories. They went after Sandman. No way. He's just on their list, too. Black Hat? Your ex? Exactly. She won't listen to me if I say she's in danger. But maybe she'd listen to someone she doesn't know. If MJ reached out to you with some addresses, would you be up for taking point on this? I got you! Thanks, really. I gotta clear my head for a bit, but call me if anything comes up, and... We're going to find Lee, Miles. I promise. Guess I've got some time until MJ calls. What's going on in the neighborhood? Hey. Maybe I should try to find some hunter hideouts. Well, I'm finally caught up. <laughs> Shoot. Alright, well... Let's see what we got here. Oh. Definitely got that going. Ooh. Is it this one? Oh, this one's neat. Let me go with that one. And Peter. Start you off. Hmm. Okay, that would be wild if I use Mig <laughs> Miguel O'Hara. Stop it here. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, you got to hit that like button, comment, and share. If you're new to the channel and enjoy my content, subscribe to the channel. What's up, Dana not, Casters? Now you've done it. I've really? seen the questions about that new Emily May Foundation. Who are they? What do they do? Well, big picture. It's an Oscorp spinoff, which we don't love, I know, but the man in charge, Harry Osborne, has got a decent rep. At the very least, he hired my favorite bee scientist, AKA apiologist, Dr. M. Young. They're the foremost expert on colony collapse disorder and 
a pretty sick ukulele player if you happen to follow them on the socials. So, young Osborne, your foundation has a lot of work to do repairing your father's legacy, but so far, you're off to a good start. Don't forget to pay your rent on the first, or, you know, withhold your checks in protest. Whatever, do you. Later. Yeah, thanks for that, Danica. Anyway, I'm gonna head out. You guys have a good one. Deuces.